Hi everybody, Josh here again from Windy Nation. Alright, so the first thing we're going to start out with is connecting the Yabushi and preface flip ring to the wire coming out of your wind turbine tower. This is the mock-up of the, your wind turbine tower. You need to use 1.5 inch scheduling pipe. And coming out of the top of your pipe, which is your tower, is the wire that you're going to run all the way from the ground up to the top of the tower. So we pretend this is the wire coming out of the top of your tower, and we need to protect, connect these three wires to the three wires coming out of the split ring. So this comes with the Winter of 500. This is your Yabushi, and the split ring comes pre-attached to it. And the first thing we're now going to do is connect the three wires coming out of the split ring to the three tower wires. So here's one wire on each side. Uh, that we've already crimped ring terminals onto. You want to make sure you crimp them on really good and tight. And after you crimp on the terminals, you can use a screw to connect these two ring terminals together, attach the nut on the other side. Before we do that, we're going to put on a piece of shrink tubing. The shrink tubing is just so after we crimp these together, we get rid of any possible short from the exposed metal. Go ahead, put the nut on. I'm not going to do it here, but you really want to have this screw and nut really tight so you can use a ratchet and screwdriver and you want to really tighten down on these two connections. After you do that, slide your shrink tubing over the connection, come with a heat gun, or if you don't have a heat gun, you can use a blow dryer, and shrink the shrink tubing onto the connection, and after you do that, you've got two more wires and coming out of the slip ring, two more wires coming out of the tower, and you just do the same thing that we just did this wire to the other side. 